2023, Nigeria will hold its general elections, ending President Muhammad Buhari's eight-year term. Nigerians, most of them, are members of the All Progressive Congress APC and the People's Democratic Party PDP, who have expressed their interest to run for the presidency in 2023. Professor Yemi Osibajo. In contention is Vice President Yemi Osibajo, who is being projected by some APC members to succeed his boss, although he hasn't publicly declared his interest in the job. Some have argued that the law professor and pastor with the redeemed Christian Church of God, RCCG, has the necessary prerequisite to take over from his boss, having undergone tutelage for eight years. But it is not clear yet whether Osibajo will contest the 2023 presidency or not, despite the ongoing consultations organized by various support groups urging him to run Chibikiro Timia Mechi. The former governor of River State and Minister of Transportation, Right Honorable Chibike Rotimiya Mechi, has been rumored in some quarters as the president's preferred candidate. In fact, the anointed candidate to take over from him in 2023. Although there has not been any display from the president to that effect, sources within the presidency claimed that the odds appeared to favor him. Recently, he was conferred with a chieftaincy title Da Amana Dara, meaning trusted son of Dara, by the Dara Emirate of Castina State, the president's hometown. The title has been interpreted in different quarters to mean the preferred, the trustworthy, and the face of Nigeria's future. This has increased the speculation that Amechi is the anointed candidate in the 2023 presidential election. Anyum Pius Anyum Anyum served as the Senate President of Nigeria from 2000 to 2003. He stated that if elected, he will manage the nation's diversity in an effective and efficient manner based on equity, justice, fairness, and inclusion. Yahaya Bello 46-year-old Kogi State Governor Bello is Nigeria's youngest governor. He announced his intention to run for president, fifth January 2022 while speaking to APC legislators and women's group in Bauchi. He has promised that if elected, he will not violate their confidence. Oji Uzo Kalu The current chief whip for the Senate House of Nigeria, Oji Uzo Kalu, announced his desire to run for president on 21st January 2022. Initially, there were no plans to run for president, but he was encouraged by leaders from the six geopolitical zones to run for the post. Kalu was the former governor of Abia State from 1999 to 2007. King Clay Mogalu Mogalu announced in October 2021 his decision to pursue his presidential ambitions under the African Democratic Congress, ADC. He was the former deputy governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, from 2009 to 2014. He was also the presidential candidate of the Young Progressives Party, YPP, in the 2019 election. Dele Mamadou Mamadou is the chief executive officer of Ovation Magazine, an African magazine founded in 1996. He said that he is the best hope for Nigeria as he was mentored by the late popular business tycoon and politician Mushud Abiola, MKO. Chukuka Monye. Monye is the founder of Siyoshi 
Consulting, a multinational operations management consulting firm. He does not belong to any political party as he intends to run as an independent candidate. Bola Ahmed Tenumbu. Tenumbu is the APC's current national leader and was the governor of Lagos State from 1999 to 2007. Widely known as the godfather of Lagos, Tinumbu has been reported to have a huge influence in shaping modern Lagos and securing Buhari's path to victory in 2015. Rochas Okorocha the former governor of Imo State and the representative of Imo Senatorial Zone, Rochas Okorocha declared his intention to contest for the presidency in 2023. He believes that Nigeria needs a detribalized citizen who can rule the country. Khadija Okunu Lamidi Okunu Lamidi is the first and only female presidential aspirant for the 2023 general election so far. She is the founder of Slice Media Solutions, an advertisement agency. She does not belong to any political party yet, with the hope that any party that shares our vision will adopt her as a presidential candidate. Sam Kowobunwa. Kowobunwa is the founder and former chief executive officer of Nameth Pharmaceutical. Obunwa has solicited leaders of the PDP to support his presidential ambitions as he believes that he is the best suited aspirant to lead the party back to power and develop Nigeria. Bukola Saraki. Saraki served as the former Senate President of Nigeria from 2015 to 2019. The PDP chieftain recently made his presidential ambitions known on 26 January 2022 through his official Facebook page. Doi Okupe Okupe is a Nigerian politician and medical practitioner who has served as the special assistant on media and publicity for Obasajo's administration. In 2002, he was a major contender for the governorship of Ogun State. In 2019, he was arrested by the EFCC on money laundering charges. Now. A member of the PDP, Okupe declared his interest in the presidency in October 2021, making promises to prioritize the needs of the poor if elected. David Umahi Umahi is the current governor of Ebony State, who is also a member of the APC. In November 2020, he deterred from the PDP to the APC, claiming a motivation to bring the Southeast region closer to the center of power. If elected as president, Umahi said his presidency will replicate his efforts in Ebony State at the national level and that he intends to bring a business-like spirit into governance.